In this video, we will focus on group 0 elements, which we call the noble gases, and the transition elements, which are the block of metals found in the middle of the periodic table. The elements in group 0 or group 8 are called noble gases. The noble gases are chemically inert, which means they are chemically unreactive elements. They do not react to form compounds and ions. This is because their electronic configurations are stable. They are monatomic, meaning they exist as single atoms. All the group 0 elements are colorless gases at room conditions. They have very low melting and boiling points. They are also insoluble in water. Noble gases are widely used due to their chemical stability. Helium is used in small balloons and in modern airships because of its low densities. Neon is used in advertising street lights. Argon is used in tungsten bulb. Its chemical stability provides an inner atmosphere to prevent oxidation of the filament. The transition elements are the block of metals between group 2 and group 3 of the periodic table. Transition elements have the following properties. They have high melting points and densities. Tungsten is a transition element and it has the highest melting point of all transition metals. Its melting point is about 3400 degrees Celsius. Tungsten is a great choice to be used as filaments for bulbs, as it does not melt even when it is hot. Transition elements have variable oxidation states in compounds. Iron has oxidation state of positive 2 in iron 2 chloride, which is FeCl2, and positive 3 in iron 3 oxide, which is Fe2O3. Manganese has oxidation state of positive 2 in manganese chloride, which is MnCl2, positive 4 in manganese 4 oxide, which is MnO2, and positive 7 in potassium manganese 7, which is KmnO4. Transition elements form colored compounds. A solution of its compound is always colored. Solutions containing iron 2 ions and iron 3 ions are pale green and yellow respectively. The colors of the compounds of a transition metal are different at different oxidation states. Copper 1 oxide is red while copper 2 oxide is black. The color of a hydrated compound may be different from that of the anhydrous compound. Hydrated copper 2 sulfate is blue while anhydrous copper 2 sulfate is white. Transition elements and their compounds are good catalysts. Catalyst is a substance that speeds up chemical reaction but remains chemically unchanged at the end of the reaction. Iron is a catalyst in the Haber process for the manufacture of ammonia. Nickel is used in the manufacture of margarine from vegetable oils. In a nutshell, noble gases are chemically inert because of their stable electronic configurations. They are monatomic and are used widely due to their chemical stability. Noble gases have very low melting and boiling points. Transition elements have high melting points and densities. Their oxidation states in compounds are variable and they form colored compounds. Transition elements and their compounds are good catalysts. If you find this video useful, do share with your friends and like the video. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more chemistry and learning resources. Have fun learning chemistry and I will see you soon.